and it's good to see them, especially young people. A lot of people in our hobby are on the elderly side, and it's good to see young says coming on. Well, the bikes are going to do a couple of laps. We line them up in the ring and have a talk with them. They'll come round individually, and hopefully we can answer a few of the questions that you would like to know the answers to. You got your injector on, John. Come on, pull! 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 Yay! Well done, one to the children. They're just driving back. To the one to the children. Foster here, all is nicely turned out this one, Marisha. 
gentleman comes from over Wales direction, West Wales, three adults, a grandson, and that engine's pulling that no problem at all. Nice to see. The engines in Burr, of course, a famous um, Paulie from back in the day. A little bit noisy in the car, but she can hear, because I know he's in about the people's engines, he did an awful lot of work. Seam really, into the low pressure, the one at the top, down to the high pressure, the cylinder at the bottom, then bone out of the chimney to draw the fire up. Large crosshead on that engine going to one con rod and one big end. Gave you the ability to have a twin cylinder engine but keep it very narrow. By the simple expedient you're still having only one big end. Then we've got uh, James Hervey Bathurst. Six ton Foden, C type, done as a tractor unit or as a palisade compound, not strictly true to say a twin cylinder, a compound engine, a, a big, big New Zealander uh, road locomotive again. Diggle's there. Yeah. No diggers all the way back there. Things go around the ring, we'll meet you back here. Okay. I'm just trying to get the ice cream sign in the back. 